Lucknow, no? Lucknow was in third position in uh, the previous year. They've uh, changed their jersey. I like the new one. It's nice. Yeah, the previous one was a bit of a whipping boy for me last season. Uh, but this one uh, we like. Let's have a look uh, at their squad. Of course, uh, their captain is KL Rahul. He's got a point to prove because here is a guy who was your test captain in December, right? In Bangladesh. Suddenly, eight weeks later, everyone's just after his head saying, oh, he shouldn't be playing. Uh, I think, and, and he's, a, again, a legit, dependable IPL yeah. batter. Yeah. He's your, you know, 500 runs. Yeah. 600. 600. 600. Yeah, 600. Sorry. Goat. He's, he's, a, your, he's your compulsory blind, right, with 600 runs. So there you go. Look at those. Just, there was, there was 2019 very underachieved. He got 593. Hmm. My God, what a bad year. That <laughs> uh, but otherwise, look at it. Those, those numbers are insanity. And there is, there's a lot of discussion about Rahul, uh, KL Rahul and strike rate, right? I mean, he's been asked questions. He's been quoted as well. But 140. In 21? But, yeah, a strike rate of 135 means you're playing what? 131, you're playing a sort of 160 kind of game. Yeah. Strike rate of 135 you're playing a 160 kind of game, which if you're playing on some ground is not enough. So if he's going to strike at 135, then he can't be playing too many balls. Yeah. So that average, I don't mind if that average drops. I don't mind if he doesn't score 600 runs because if he scores 500 runs or 480 runs or 500 runs at a strike rate of 150, which he can because he's got very, very unique skills, he'll win more games for his side. Fair. And, yeah. and they've got the batting, not that they don't have the batting, they've, yeah. they've got the batting, but Rahul sometimes falls into the trap of thinking, I need to bat responsibly. Yeah. I need to bat well. I think it's a curse of playing for Punjab for a while. Because Punjab, you always wonder, there's nobody behind me after this Mujay Kinn. Like. Short circuits, huh? Yeah. Short circuits your brain a little bit, isn't it? Uh, there's no Mohsin, right? Mohsin's injured. Very sad story. Uh, I, th I thought this would have been Mohsin's big year. Had blood clots in his shoulder. They were worried about whether he'll be ever able to play cricket again. But luckily, he's come back now. He's in the camp, but he's not yet bowling. Yeah. So, I don't see him playing. In all honesty, I don't see him playing this year. Hmm. I mean, last year, he only played nine games, but he was sensational. He was that one bowler who said, watch me. Yeah. And all of a sudden, he's not there. And that, I think that leaves a big hole in that side now. Yeah. Where do you I mean, look at that? They've they've bought some batters. It's they looking pretty so solid. Batters. Who? Where do you? Where are you batting them? Because you're opening with Rahul and Dikop, right? Where are you, you going play after? Puran, that? Puran has no. You I think you play Puran at three. I'd play Puran at three because if you've got to play Puran and he's going to be explosive for you, he has to play at three. Then you have Huda. You have Pandya. Stoinis. Stoinis again. You you float. Okay. Okay. You let's wave six. Ayush is Ayush playing in your team? Uh not in my team really. At this point in time, from there, I'm looking at getting another bowler in. Maybe a Krishna Gautam because I think he's he's capable, he hits the big one. The big one for me here is also Mark Wood. See, remember, last year they didn't have the enforcer <coughs> bowler. They got Chamira in because he was injured. Yeah. This year, they have Mark Wood. Yeah. And Mark Wood and Puran are both, again, this word is now going to be this year's word, impact. Yeah. They're both bowlers who can, uh, batsmen, uh, batsmen and bowler who can make a difference. And I mean, Puran has had horrible seasons. But... Gautam Gambhir is no mug. He's yeah. played 16 crores for this guy. He knows that one season on, he can... Puran will never be as bad as he was last season. Let's put it that way. Yeah. Okay. He wins two games for them. Look at the rest of the batting. He's, you have Dikok will win a couple for you. Rahul will win a couple for you. Then it's a different team altogether. Which is why I'm very, very hot on this team. I saw Dikok bat the other day. <laughs> I mean, there's this... this 285 the, chasing? They yeah. chase 258. Sorry, 258. Yeah, they chase 258. Yeah. There's Johnson Charles, it's 139 balls. He's okay, I'll hit one in 40 balls. Yeah, 40, yeah. 40, 44 balls. <laughs> that is the opening partnership. Yeah. KL Rahul, Quinton Dukok. I think, you know, I know I can see why Puran at three, but I'd still go Huda at three because you get a right-hander in, you get a left-hander uh, after fair. that. Maybe Huda Rahul. It depends on who gets out. Yeah. And then it'd be how they, last year, they had Stoinis, they hardly used Stoinis. Correct. So I hope they use Stoinis well. But again, you talked about Badoni, that number six might be tricky. Number seven is Krunal Pandya, whose batting has just gone off. I hope he's recovered from his injury because he's a good player. But I hope he recovers from his injury well enough because his batting has just dropped off a little bit. Wood is a very interesting one. Can he give you 14 games with his body? If with his body, if he gives you 14 games, Australia will be celebrating wildly <laughs> because he won't play the Ashes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a good one. So that's why they've got that Romario Shepherd. Yeah. They've got Sam's. Romario Shepherd is the world's greatest 15 ball batter. 
Yeah. He'll come at the end, he'll give you anywhere from 25 to 40 runs. Again, good substitution situation. Yeah. Oh, but you can't interest. substitute the overseas player. Oh, huh. Unless oh, you yeah. play with three. Yeah. yeah. Uh, let's talk about Ravi Bishnoi. Because he's one of the players that obviously, they got him in the draft last year. Uh, he didn't have the kind of season they would have wanted from him. Uh, but genuine talent. But seems to, in the last 12 months, has just kind of drifted away from the radar a bit. I would like someone to put their arm around Ravi Bishnoi. <coughs> Yeah. And said, Bete, tu mein hai honar. Because we were sitting in this studio. Might have been the, Did he play the Asia Cup? I think he played. I think he played the Asia yes. Cup. I think he did, the yes. India Pakistan game. And we are thinking who'll bowl the last four, five overs. And the one guy who was bowling really well was Bishnoi. And you're thinking, right, Bishnoi will bowl well. And suddenly he's bowling the difficult overs for India. And the editor cut out his rest of his scenes. <laughs> Never seen again. Yeah. I think he's a quality player and I think Bishnoi, Chahel, Kuldeep, these are three wrist spinners around whom you can you can build, you can pick any two at any given point. I only wish Bishnoi also batted. You can't have all three wrist spinners who don't bat. Yeah, but he's plus in the field. Mm. He's a good one. Yeah, he's, he's a good player. No, no, no. He will only drop it if it's an easy catch. Uh -huh. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. That's right. He he only catches them when he has to run and right. die. When he runs, comes straight out if he loses <laughs> focus. <laughs> like, what is this? Boring. <laughs> but I'll tell you one thing. The other interesting thing is what I think Bishnoi had a season under Kumble when I think in Punjab. Yes. Punjab. And I think that has made a huge difference because see, everyone used to talk about him being basically predominantly the ugly bowler. He doesn't bowl. He doesn't bowl the leg break at all. And somebody like a Kumble turning around and saying, "Son, I've taken so many international wickets with just basically yeah. not using anything else. I didn't spin the ball very much. I think a chat that has also calmed him down as a player. I think he's yeah. really capable. I mean, I remember I, I was doing commentary. I said exactly what Joy said. I said he's predominantly googly bowler, predominantly googly bowler. I've done the build-up. He's taken a bit of time and he bowls two leg breaks first too. <laughs> <laughs> so, he's, he's, he started bowling leggies as well. But I have a lot of time for Bishnoi. He's one of my players to watch out for in this year's IPL. Is the team to watch out for? What do you think? Yeah? Playoff chances? I'm there. Oh, I, there you go. Not sure. Yeah, me neither. I don't know. Not sure. I'm feeling the vibe. Not Just, sure. Just, you know, Lucknow fans are going to go, what, what? What's that? Analysis. I'm like, we should not feel no, the vibe. No, they won't say what, They'll say, Ji, Huzur, aapne Ji, Huzur, aise kyun kaha? Aisa. Koi gustakhi to nahi hui hum se ke aap.